Cindy and I are heading out west. First stop, barbecue. Now we're off to Diamond, Missouri to see the George Washington Carver National Monument. He invented crop rotation, developed more than 300 foods, and created the peanut. confronted Carver constantly throughout his lifetime in his search for learning, in his work, in his relationships. Yet time and again, his resilience triumphed over adversity. Our next stop was the Chickasaw National Recreation Area, where we hiked and saw a bison, a.k.a. buffalo. So here we are in Santa Fe, New Mexico, just outside of town. Found this really nice hiking trail. You know, off in the distance, we got some beautiful peaks. I guess it snows here. to another National Historic Park. The name of it is Picos. It's in New Mexico. We learned that in 1541 that the Spaniards landed in this area and wanted to colonize the Picos Native Americans. Yeah, it's for something, though. 
so wild in New Mexico. What the heck? Let's visit the town of Madrid. It's where the Main Street Diner is and where the Wild Hogs movie was filmed. Welcome to Petroglyph National Monument. There are 23,000 petroglyphs in this 17 mile long volcanic area. As many as 40,000 Native Americans lived here between 1300 and 1540. He's coming close, he understands. El Pais National Monument is our last national monument on our tour out west. We were amazed as we learned that this is an inactive volcano and all the black rock you see is actually volcanic lava. I hope you can see how far and wide this crater is. Our first national park of this trip will be the Petrified Forest Natural Park. We're going to hike the Blue Forest Trail. We're going to see the Rings of Color the Painted Desert Inn that is located near the historic Route 66. When I look out at rocks, I see layers. And each of those layers was the land surface at a certain point in time. And animals lived on that, plants grew on it and interacted, and eventually another layer was deposited on top, animals and plants grew on that one, and another layer on top. As each layer is exposed, clues are uncovered, shedding new light on the spectacular story of Petrified Forest.
Wow, Sedona's been a great time. We've done lots of hiking and sightseeing, and now that it's our last evening, we decide to take in some saxophone at a dinner theater. Now, I should say that Sedona, Arizona only gets three and a half inches of snow per year. While the saxophone was playing, seven inches of snow got dumped on us and we could not drive out of the city. We had to find a hotel to get us through the night until the next day when the plows came through. Goodbye, Sedona. Wow, did we have nice weather in Tucson, Arizona. So we set out to Socorro National Park. I have to say that the views off the twisty and hilly roads on the way to the visitor center were all excellent. The name of the visitor center that we visited was the Red Hills Visitor Center. From there we got our map and headed to the Hugh Norris Trailhead. I hope you like the pictures. Yahoo! We made it to California. So while we're in California, why not do Joshua Tree National Park? We ended up at the Northwest Visitor Center and eventually drove down to the Maze Loop Trailhead. There are three entrances to this national park and we chose the northwest entrance to go down to this trailhead. We were very fortunate to get the sunset. What a beautiful place. We will return. Ventura, California is one of our favorite places. The beaches are amazing. There's plenty of places to hike to. The sunsets are gorgeous. And there's a, it's a small town atmosphere with the nightlife. One of our hikes was at the Ventura Botanical Gardens. Because of all the rain California has had, there was plenty of flowers. We had great meals there as well. Los Alamos, California is a town that has wine tasting and from farm to table restaurants. It was fun, but beers and a pool game is fine for us. After driving south for about 30 miles on Highway 1, we arrived at Big Sur and Pfeiffer Falls Trailhead. But first, we walked across this bridge and took in the sights of these beautiful redwoods in the camping area.
coastline we saw from Carmel to Big Sur. Thank you, Cindy, for pointing out extra fun along the way. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.